Welcome back. It's so good to see you. Yes, are you ready? Perfect. You know the drill. Here at the Lolly Lisa Questionnaire Clinic, it is very important that I pull up your file. So, first name. Last name. And your date of birth, starting with the day month, and year. Lovely. Let us pull up your file here. There you are. Oh, very topical. Nice. I'll explain in just one minute. Let's just transfer these questions over.
Question 10. Would you rather have a garden filled with edible plants or a garden filled with colorful butterflies? Question 11. Would you rather spend a spring day exploring a botanical garden or exploring a butterfly conservatory? Question 12. Would you rather have the ability to control the direction of the wind or the temperature of the air, but only during the springtime? Question 13. Would you rather have a hammock under a blooming magnolia tree or a swinging bench? beneath a cherry blossom canopy. Question 14. Would you rather have a springtime adventure in a vibrant city or in a tranquil countryside? Question 15. Would you rather have the power to bring back an extinct flower every springtime or to discover a new species of plant every springtime? Sixteen. Would you rather attend a spring music festival surrounded by wildflowers or a cultural festival celebrating diverse spring traditions? Question 17. Would you rather have a never-ending supply of fresh strawberries or a field of daisies that never wilt? Question 18. Would you rather have a springtime wardrobe filled with pastel colors in a single pattern or a vibrant wardrobe filled with springtime patterns in vibrant shapes? Question 19. Would you rather have a springtime ritual of planting trees or a springtime ritual of releasing butterflies into the wild? Question 20. Would you rather have a springtime vacation in a tropical paradise or a springtime vacation in a cozy cabin in the woods? Question 21. Would you rather have the ability to understand the language of birds or the ability to understand the whispers of blooming flowers? Question 22. Would you rather have a springtime adventure exploring hidden waterfalls or a springtime adventure exploring secret gardens? Question 23. Would you rather have a talent for creating intricate flower arrangements or at painting colorful landscapes? Twenty-four. Would you rather have a springtime job as a beekeeper or a springtime job as a professional kite flyer? Question twenty-five. 
Would you rather have the power to bring rain to drought-stricken areas or the power to stop destructive spring storms altogether? Question 26. Would you rather have a springtime home adorned with fairy lights or a springtime home adorned with Easter decorations? Question 27. Would you rather spend a spring day volunteering at an animal shelter or spend the same day planting trees in a community garden? Twenty-eight. Would you rather have the ability to control the length of daylight hours or the intensity of moonlight during the spring night? Twenty-nine. Would you rather have a springtime activity such as horseback riding or a springtime activity such as picking berries. Question 30. Would you rather have a garden filled with fireflies or a pond teeming with colorful koi fish? Thirty-one. Would you rather have a springtime tradition of hosting an outdoor movie night or the tradition of a rooftop garden party? Thirty-two. Would you rather have a springtime talent for creating intricate sand sculptures or elaborate flower crowns? Thirty-three. Would you rather have a springtime Easter hunt or a springtime storybook session where you read your favorite Easter books? Thirty-four. Would you rather have the ability to predict the first bloom of cherry blossoms or the arrival of of migrating birds. 35. Would you rather have a springtime hobby of walking around colorful neighborhoods or a hobby of bird watching? 36. Would you prefer a springtime adventure of camping in the wilderness or of glamping in a luxurious safari-style tent? 37. Would you rather have a springtime wardrobe inspired by vintage floral patterns or a springtime wardrobe consisting of modern but minimalist designs? 38. Would you rather have the physical springtime job as a professional gardener or a landscape photographer? 39. Would you rather have the power to make it rain or the power to bring out the sun during the springtime? 40. Would you rather have the springtime tradition of watching every sunrise or the springtime tradition of watching every sunset? 
41. Would you rather have a garden filled with blooming tulips or a greenhouse garden overflowing with succulents? Forty-two. Would you rather have a unique springtime adventure, such as exploring ancient rooms, or do you prefer to explore hidden caves? Forty-three. Would you rather have the springtime ability to control the pollination process of bees, or the migration patterns of butterflies. 44. Would you rather compose spring-style inspired poetry or paint spring-style landscape masterpieces? 45. Would you rather have a home with sun-drenched porch springtime vibes or a cozy reading nook by the fire? 46. Would you rather have a springtime hobby of foraging for wild mushrooms or the springtime hobby of searching for hidden waterfalls. 47. Would you rather have the tradition of attending an outdoor yoga session with lambs, or would you rather participate in a community garden activity? 48. Would you rather overindulge in your favorite springtime Easter style candies such as chocolates and bonbons or would you rather have a delicious spring style Easter inspired savory meal? 49. Would you rather have a spring that is filled with spring showers or a spring that is filled with a lot of humidity in the air every day? 50. Would you rather have the season remain springtime all year round or have the season be a second fall? all year round. Autumn, yes? Mm -hmm. Okay. Wonderful. You've just completed the 50 Would You Rather style spring edition questions. How did you like that? Okay. Hold that thought. I'm just transferring your answers over. Switching devices. Got it. You did wonderful. Thank you for answering. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's be sure that I'm inputting the 50 spring tile question. Would you rather addition? Mm -hmm. Just a few more questions before you go. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much did you enjoy spring as being the theme of today's questionnaire? Okay. And on a scale of 1 to 10, how much did you enjoy my interview style? And on a scale of 1 to 10, how likely would you be in completing another questionnaire? here at the Loving Lisa Questionnaire Clinic. Okay. And just share a brief input here, but do you enjoy when the videos are a little bit more easygoing, such as this, or do you prefer when they're a little bit more intense and personal? Okay. 
Mm-hmm. Okay. Thank you. Well, you have completed another questionnaire. We do thank you for your honest and efficient answers. If you would like to share your answers with the group, please feel free to do so. Otherwise, you know that your answers are always confidential. Okay, and on your way out, please do help yourself to some Easter chocolates and candies. We have an array of mini eggs and chocolate covered eggs and chocolate filled eggs and anything your little heart would desire. So just take a handful on your way out, okay? And get home safely because it is raining. All right. Thank you for completing another questionnaire with us, and I do look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye-bye!